Good morning you guys welcome back to another vlog sorry for how I look it is Monday the 29th I just got up well I just got out of the bed I've been awake for a while I'm currently doing my chores Brian is off today because it's Memorial Day so I'm about to just get things rolling and going so yeah So I read that you should let your bed air out every morning. So I'm going to try to start doing that. Um, it's probably going to really irk me. Brian's home, so it's extra loud in here first thing in the morning. But, um, yeah, I read that you're supposed to let your bed air out every morning. So I'm going to try to start doing that. Uh, it is Monday, so I'm going to get to cleaning this bathroom. I was going to scrub the shower, but I'm cramping. So we're not going to do that. We'll do that next week. When I'm not dying, so yeah, I'm gonna get this bathroom clean and then I don't want to turn the light on for you all because it does those weird things. So I'll see y'all after I clean the bathroom. Mm -hmm. I can make you stay Cause baby I love you Why you tryna break us up When I'm tryna build it up I wish I could make you stop Cause baby I love you Guess I'm gonna dance alone tonight I'm gonna miss your body You know I can never get it right Without you, no I don't wanna step into the light If I don't get you shoddy
Watching videos of us I have been trying to get rid of your stuff But voices in my head are telling me to stop It's all I have left, all I have of you Thought I was more than a body to hold, baby I wanted you, wanted us to be something more I was so sure I let my guard down for you Baby, why'd you have to love me, love me like that? I gave you my heart and you tore it apart Don't know why you had to hurt me, hurt me like that Cause now I'm messed up, drinking non-stop Just trying to forget you and everything we said But I can't seem to get these thoughts out of my head Baby, why'd you have to love me, love me like that Love me like that Oh, staying inside in my bed all day long all right you guys like the whole day is gone <laughs> um after i cleaned i just kind of hung out with ryan um obviously did like my bible study stuff and my devotional for tiktok i just finished cooking dinner it's eight, eight o'clock done right on the dot i made some chicken spaghetti with some garlic bread um, I also did like a quick little like 15 minute workout in the living room while we were watching Game of Thrones. So yeah, we're about to eat dinner. And that's it for my Monday, honestly. Yeah, I just got a whole bunch of laundry to put up. Watch. I'm going to show you how much laundry it is. It is insane. It's an insane amount of laundry. Well, if you know me and you know that I don't typically allow this much laundry to pile up. But, yeah, that's what we're going to do, is just eat dinner, put up laundry, and then go to bed. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. What is up, you guys? Today is Tuesday. Um, so, funny story, I think I, lo I lost my phone today. Well, I didn't lose it. I knew exactly where I left it, which was at Walmart, and I was just like, praying, praying, praying. And then, because I was with my mom today, I don't have the car today, we were riding in her car, so I had to call her, like, right, well, first I had to call my sister, because only, so my mom does not have an iPhone, but my sister does, so I was calling my sister on my, oh, look, there's my mom with my phone, hold on, okay, I got the phone, look at this message that you can put on there, like, whenever you go onto another Apple device, you can do something like this, so that's what I put on there, you can put a little message on there, because I turned on, like, the lost iPhone mode, so on, on there I said, hello, my name is Allie. I'm currently tracking my phone. Please return it safely. Thanks in advance. And then it has my number on there to call if somebody found it. And then, like, it gives them the option to call. Uh, well, I guess that was stupid. I should have put my mom's number because if they pressed call, like, it would call my number. You live and you learn. But nonetheless... Your girl got her phone back. I was so nervous. But look at how legit Apple is within tracking your phone. I've already given y'all one warning. I have already given y'all one warning. I won't give another. Look, it shows. This is what the tracking looks like on uh, the computer. So you can... Um, It shows you like almost every single, like every little step of the way that they went. And then obviously here is where my phone is currently at. So legit. I'm so glad. Now I got to figure out how to take my phone off of this um, lost move. <laughs> uh, uh, 
Oh, I can turn it off. Okay. So let's see what it does. Let's see what it does on my camera. Let's see. Turn off. Wow, when you take it off of lost mode, it turns off the whole little uh, track. Like the tracking. See the whole little track went away? But... Whew, glory to God. I was praying over it. I was so nervous and so scared. But you know what? We got it now. We got it now. That's all that matters. Dang, you got to re-verify everything when you take it off the lost mode. So I highly recommend, if you have an iPhone, try to find another Apple device or go on to where's my, findmyiphone.com and do that lost mode thing because it puts your phone on lockdown. Like you can't do anything on it. So, yeah. But, um, yeah, I'm about to just edit. So I need to plug the computer, the my phone into the computer. But, yeah, so I was hanging out with my mom today. We went to lunch, homeschooled the boys. King had speech therapy. Excuse me. That's about it. I think we're just going to hang out. The boys are laying down for a nap, and Brian's still at work. So, just hanging out. Mm -hmm. We decided to bring them to the park since we haven't been able to like go to the park in such a long time because it was raining for like two, three weeks straight. So we decided to go ahead and bring them to the park. We're going to have a little picnic. I made some um, grilled cheese sandwiches for the boys. And then I made Brian and I some Southwest chicken salads. And that's what we're going to have. Oh, it's closing. Okay, but yeah, the boys are playing right now. It is about it is 840. And the, yes, the sun is still out like this in Texas. Brian did not believe me when I told him in the summers it does not get dark till about 9 o'clock, 9.15. And this, we're not even at the peak of summer yet, so. <laughs> okay. This is Brian right there, King's right there. Oh, yeah. There's Ethan. And then there's Bryson. <laughs> that so pretty. So pretty. Lubbock has its little hidden gems. They always give me anxiety when they want to come look over here. And I'm going to show y'all why. It's this little pier. This little dot. Whatever you want to call it. Look how much space. Like, they should have put way more bars on these things. Way more. Ethan, don't stand up there. Oh, you will fall. You still got the ducks. I have to get the ocean. Don't you get up there. Don't even think about it. Mm -hmm. Go, Brian. Mm -hmm. Go, Ethan. Just it, there's no. Just go. Hi guys. Oh, that burned. Oh, Hi guys. Oh, oh, oh. oh. That burned my eyes. Oh, oh, oh. Burn my eyes, mom. Oh, yeah, it doesn't burn my eyes because I have glasses. <laughs> All right, you guys, it's it's currently 9.42. We were here at the park for exactly one hour. We played, we ate, and we are headed home. We're all going to wind down, get ready for bed, brush our teeth, and just I'm gonna probably let the boys watch TV for a little bit if, they, if their room is clean and stuff. But, um, yeah, we had a good little night. You know, I'm just trying to figure out more, like, cheap, more, that made me look cross-eyed. We're getting one. <laughs> trying to figure out more like cheap and affordable ways that we could do like family night and family time and stuff like that and tonight was a good way so if you need like a cheap night to do something with your family I highly recommend like just packing up your dinner taking it to the park it was it was really nice so yeah I'll see you guys once we get home
Yes, OAG. Alright, you guys. I know I have not vlogged at all today. Um, but I'm making dinner. I'm watching YouTube. And then I am going to make um, steak, steak things, steak foil packs. Hopefully they'll be done in like 15 minutes because I have the air fryer mode on. And the boys are playing outside in the rain, but Brian just told me he wants them to come inside. No! Get in bed. Optimus, get in bed. Bed! About to do a quick home workout like literally like 10 15 minutes I'm gonna just do like a quick little like core rehab full body type deal so just like some legs some quick arms and quick backs at that angle was making my dark circles look intense so yeah I'm just gonna go ahead and do that real quick I'm just while I watch some vlogs and stuff I'm not gonna set up the bench even though I do have it out and ready for whenever I do work out at home 
But yeah, I'm just going to do like some workouts that I've been seeing that I really need to do. So let's just go ahead and get to it. All right, you guys, like as you guys seen, I did three sets of all four of those workouts. So like I said, it was just a little something to get my body moving. I'm just trying to remain consistent within getting my body moving because I don't want to get it. I don't want my body to get too used to remaining stagnant. So that's kind of something similar that I did Monday night. So there's that. Um, the foil packs were ready at about 9.30. This is the time I usually eat, you guys, between 9, 8.30 and 9.30. So yeah, um, I'm really kind of glad that we're not really dirty any dishes other than like the forks. Because then once we take this foil off of our plate, I shouldn't have to wash them. But yeah, this is how it looks. It looks like it's going to taste so good and I'm so excited. So we're going to go. The boys say that it tastes delicious. Hi guys. Um, so yeah, we're all about to eat dinner right now. So Tomorrow. This is that ice thing that I got off of the team room. This is what the ice looks like.
Good morning, you guys. It is 6.20 in the morning. Today is June 1st. It's actually my dad's birthday. We have plans later uh, to meet up with, like, all my sisters that live locally for his birthday. So, um, but other than that, it's library day. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to get the water boiling for, uh, to mop today while I fix my bed and um, I got my coffee going you guys saw that excuse me I just so good I don't know maybe it's just the way I make it but I really do like Javi coffee so um yeah but yeah let's go ahead and get these chores started and then today Time to go fix the bed now. Oh, I almost forgot my coffee. Because after I fix my bed, if the water's not done, I'm going to do my makeup real fast. We've got another rainy day, guys. We need to cut our grass. <laughs> Another rainy day. But I don't mind it. It feels so good. It feels so good. Um, I did finish all my chores. I'm about to sit down and do like my TikTok devotional. And then I'm also going to do my reading at the word and my gospel and my motherhood. Y'all, I have been slacking on my Roman study, but I'm really going to get back on it tonight. I really want that to be my before bed devotional time. So I'm really, really, really going to get back on that tonight. But my back hurts. My hips hurt. After I'm done reading and like doing my devotional for TikTok, I'm going to go ahead and get the boys up. And maybe we can, because it's only 7.40. It's only 7.40, so get them up at about 8 o'clock. And then uh, go ahead and head to the library by the time it opens. So we can go ahead and have school and stuff done by the time it's story time. So then by the time story time's over, they can just pick their books and we can come back home. And we can have some chill time. But um, yeah, we're still going to go to the library. I, I really don't want to get out of routine. When I get out of routine, that's really not good for me mentally, especially with today being what today is. So, yeah, those are the plans. Um, so, yeah, I guess I'll see you guys once me and the boys get to the library. This is today's craft at the library. 
Little campsite. That little piece don't matter. Just that little piece don't matter. Here, it'll still stick to it. Oh my God. Can we do a competition?